guys, sorry for bursting your eardrums. I apologize to the people who complain about me saying hi, guys, but we're not changing that intro because it is an awesome intro, guys. Hi, guys! Welcome today to a full team of showdown players, whether they be boosted with the red versions like Carvalho, Fafana, Turam, and Trossard, or not boosted like uh, Nesri, Coria, Orsic, Palisic. Now, a lot of them have lost games and are not going to upgrade, but there is still four active players uh, in this team which could get upgraded. Coria and um, Coria, Upamecano for the final, which is on Sunday. And then by the time the video goes live, you guys will know who will be upgraded between Orsic and Agurd at the centre-back position. But it is brilliant. Now, continuing the fact of doing discards in videos... Let's cover something. A few people have told me to start min-listing players, guys. I am not going to do that. There's two reasons. If you guys are hardcore free for players and you know already, if I min-list a player, a normal player isn't getting that card. A bot's going to get that card who farms coins and doesn't do the game as you want to. It doesn't go... As much as, as good as it looks, we know that an, an average free for player isn't getting that. So today, for the player we put on the wheel, guys, for every loss that we get... One player is going to be discarded, right? And then we're going to throw some thief points to you guys in the comment section below, guys. Let me know who you think is going to win the World Cup final. Is it going to be Argentina with Lionel Messi? Or is it going to be um, France with uh, with Mbappe? That's the final. It's a big question, guys. Comment down below and uh, we'll get to picking a winner. So let's get on and build the full showdown team. Leave a like rating, right hit the bell button, all that good stuff. Let's get into it and play some games. Okay, Ducky. Moving on into the centre back position on the left hand side, guys. And obviously, it's going to be pretty easy. We're just going to look for showdown players. Some of them are upgraded, some of them are not. And the first one in the middle is going to be Upa Mencano, who's brand new as of yesterday. He joins with a Gerd, who's also a brand new one. And them two have still got potential of getting boosted. And the third one is going to be Jimenez. So that is my three centre back positions. I'm going to smooth them around as well. None of them are boosted at the moment, but to be honest, Two of them could be boosted by the end of the weekend. So there we are, 85, 86, 87. And obviously, Upamecano and Coria both come in at 200k, which is a pretty steep price for these showdowns. Not bad. Defence complete. We'll come back to the goalkeeper at the end. In the centre midfield position on the left-hand side, guys, it is going to be none other. Like I said, guys, may as well search on through and have a look for them. The first one is a lot of people which have been hyped about him all week. It is Fernandez, um, Enzo Fernandez. I'm hyped about him, guys. He might be joining Liverpool. Whether that comes to fruition, I do not know. And then his partner in crime is going to be Kovacic. So that's me and my memory field, guys. Two of the red or pinkish showdowns: Enzo, um, which has got Hullet stats, and uh, also Kovacic, which isn't far off, but has really high dribbling. It's not a bad team, is it? Does it look playable? We'll find out in a few minutes. In the left midfield position the left side it's uh, gonna be a player which i moved from a left back to a left mid guys it is akuna um of severe throwing in some links uh, to none other than jimenez and enzo um and offers some more links further on in the team and obviously he's a boosted one as well and then continuing the boosted run guys we've got a right mid which is going to be zayech who looks very good by the way zayech looks very good getting those 10 points to uh Agurd and kovacic not a bad holding midfield guys it just looks a beautiful team, right? I don't know, guys. I like the way it looks. It looks good. In the camp position, we move to Holland or Netherlands. And it is going to be, not Berghaus, because Berghaus didn't get one, guys. It is going to be class and one of the early ones, going from an 85 to an 87. And uh, as you can tell, we're probably going to finish off with the Dutch links. Now, we've got one boosted, one non-boosted. First boosted, and bear with me, guys, as I do have a lot of attackers in my team, uh, in my club, sorry. Um, the first one is going to be Bergwijn, jumping on in there as the first boosted. And the final one is going to be a bit one which didn't get boosted. But I believe, and it'd be nice, guys, if we clicked on the card, you can tell where this was from. Memphis Depay. Was that Depay versus Argentina? I can't remember. But there it is, guys. The trio of Holland up front with Bergwijn, Klaassen and Depay. So that was a very big ask was that Depay to get a boost if Netherlands beat um, obviously Argentina it would have been amazing but it didn't happen but there it is the full team but we're not finished guys now EA absolutely hate giving special cards out to uh, to players in net so we're going to fix it for them guys and we are putting Edwin van der Sar in to take us to some decent chemistry now he will not be on the discard pile but 
the rest of the players will. So in front of you guys, a team full of showdown players. Like I said, for every person who's on the list who gets drawn if we lose a game, and we are playing champs as well, I'll put them on the discard pile, roll it and see which player and find out how much his value was on an SBC and find a player to discard. And then we're going to throw some FIFA points to you. Guys, let's get into the game. Leave a like rating and see how we do in foot champs. Right, guys, our first opponent, Oxford United with an XL badge. That is not a good sign because you guys know who XL... Bloody hell. How the hell am I going to beat that? Well, what a great start, guys. To pie. Oh, he scored. What a finish, guys. We are 1-0 up. Upa Mencano is absolutely bossing this defence as well. Bang, look at that. Should have been saved, but a cracking goal. Memphis to pie, 1-0. No. Good block. What a goal. Bang. Hey, Enzo Fernandez. Future Liverpool player, apparently. Makes it 2 1. Boosh. Eat that bad boy out. And I reckon I see him quite a lot in, in Weekend League as well. If people have got the uh, right back to bring him in. Enzo again. Nice. Klaassen. Oh, 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 go on. Nice. There's number three, guys. Scruffy goal, but we take it. Good ball. Bang. Oh, it's class and making number four. We are cruising, guys. We might have stopped at this guy. Have we? We have. But let's see who it would have been. Guys, here is a wheel with all of the players in there. All right. This is who we would have discarded today. He would have lost that game. Turam. Don't know how much it's worth, guys, but we saved anyway. GG's. Right, guys. Our second and final game versus the Pigeon Paradise. The team that he has got. Dudek, Varan Marquez, Hudson Adoy, who I actually struggle against. Call. Hmm. I'll take that, guys. I'll take that team. Will I beat it? Who knows? Let's see. Showdowns, show off. Oh, who is that, guys? Bergwijn. Really don't get on with Bergwijn. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. You're getting a conversation about my night out I was meant to be having tonight. Um, we're meant to be going out for a meal. What a goal that was, by the way. Um, but we've had to... Catch the kids are only going to the Natalie's mum's as well. But that is not taking place now because Bates will probably fall over and snap his fat hip or his fat ankle or break his fat hands or something. Um, so we're just going to have a family night and watch some films, I think. Mm, that's the plan. Guys, this team is crap. I, guys, this team's pretty cracked. I won't lie. For, for, I thought this showdown team wouldn't be that good. But as a collective, it's very good. And there's 2 0. And my man's rage quit. So we actually don't discard anything today. But who would we have discarded? Oh, not bad. Now, with that, instead of doing discards, guys, we're going to do something else instead. I asked you guys to comment at the start of the video or something. Hopefully you did. Because. So, I asked you guys to comment down below who you think is going to be winning the World Cup final. France or Argentina. I'm going to pick some people, two of them, to win 6,000 free points each, guys. So make sure you comment down below. It doesn't matter who wins. I just want you guys to comment and let me know. Leave a like on the video, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll reach out to you into comments, guys, and get your Twitter and, uh, and sort it out via that, guys. So, 6,000 free points to two of you. All you got to do is comment who you think is going to win the World Cup today. So, guys, come and check me out on Twitch. See you on the pitch. Good evening. What? Bye. Au revoir.